All right, welcome guys to this next part of the tutorial. And here we're going to um, we're going to create the occupation chosen, physics engineer, annual salary part. So let's do that right away. So we go back here, and uh, what we want to do is we want to go back down here and we want to create another. Uh, we want to create another. I think um, another div row. We have to create another div row. All right, guys. So we're gonna do this and go row. And here we're gonna say all right h2 with a text center once again and say occupation chosen so the chosen occupation so what whatever occupation you choose stick with it don't keep on changing from this to that unless your job requires you to so that's how you make more money in the long run in my opinion you, you become an expert in one field and you specialize so that your expertise matter more and more and it's more value that's how you make more money even in programming you have to choose what you want and stick with it. That's how you make more money, in my opinion. Unless you're like a teacher and you have to know like a variety of different programming languages, uh, or unless you're trying to like learn different programming concepts and you have to choose different programming languages languages to become a more well-rounded programmer. That's the other reason why you want to choose different, learn different types of programming. But otherwise, you got to stick with one thing and get good at it. That's how you become more paid. Well, so let's see. Um, Occupation chosen, div row, and here I'm going to say button, button, button large, and inside we're going to say, this is VGS command, we haven't created the VGS part yet, but we will, but we're just going to say uh, here chosen occupation, if we go back here, refresh the page, it's going to have this weird button here, and uh, what I want is, I want, uh, and button is spelled wrong so button okay button now that should work button all right there you go and now we want to make this button green because the color of money is green and we want more green so let's go here to um we're gonna go uh we're gonna go style and background color equals green now is green is natural green the most money color? No, I think it's like slightly dirty green because cash is dirty, right? Or or like more pristine green because you're a bank bank cashier or owner or something like that. I don't know. Anyways, we're gonna do that. And I, let's see, a physics engineer. And I think button. Why isn't it large? Button. Oh, button large. Okay, button large. Fresh. Okay, there you go. And then we want it centered, so we go back here. And I think under class you go text. Uh, center. No, I think. I think I have to do it on the div. Text center. Um, let's see. Text. Text. Yeah, I have to do it on the div. So text. Style. Text. Line. Center. All right. Refresh the page. Yeah, there you go. Text center. And then we want to say annual salary. So. Let's create a break tag and let's see h3 annual salary is equal to a dollar sign and we're gonna say chosen occupation salary. Alright, so there we go. Fresh the page and annual salary is equal to that. And once again, once we fill out the uh, the VGS variables, these will update to the proper amount and we're gonna start with the zero. Um, cause everyone, even billionaires, one started with a zero. When a billionaire was born, nobody is born with a net worth more than zero dollars. Everyone's net worth when they are born is equally zero. So you just gotta learn how to make that change for you. So, um, I go, I go down here and let's go row. And we're gonna create, we're gonna create the buttons. Whoops. We're gonna create the buttons for work and then earn income and save save income so if we rush to zero it's all zero physics engineer work 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 save 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 save, save. all right so um I go back to uh annual salary occupation all right um all right so let's see what do i have to do next it is um I think okay wait so I have to create a new line so I have to create a new row all right so new row new row oh, I already created a new row okay, a new row here all right new row and then 
call SM4, whoops, times three. And all right, so let's do that. And here we're gonna say button, button, button success, button large, and we're gonna say work. And then here we're gonna say uh, H3 earned income, and once again, dollar sign. And then we're just gonna say inside here, earned income. So these are gonna be data variables. We're gonna create these real soon. Saved income. Income. And if I if I am continue to get broke while I make this tutorial videos, I'm gonna eventually just make a Udemy course because that's one way I can sell my expertise on Laravel and VGS. But until I have to do that, I want to figure out how to way to make you guys more affluent and to make you guys watching this tutorial to make you guys more affluent is help you guys think about money in a way that makes you more affluent. So that's my goal for you guys. If I don't accomplish that, you don't have to come to my channel and watch these videos. Anyways, um, let's go down here. All right, so if we go back here, sorry for just moving around so much, but we got earned income, saved income. Why is it looking so weird? I think it's because um, I haven't created a margin. All right, so let's uh, let's go back here and let's create a margin. Let's go back here, style, and then let's create a style. Margin top is equal to 30 pixels. All right, so now we're gonna have to work on this later, but it'll come. Um, so let's see. And we have to create the save button. So what we're gonna do here is we're gonna create one more, uh, one more div class. We call it call sm12, and we're gonna say button 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 primary because saving is important, and then form control so the button is big, so saving is big. And then we're going to actually create one more custom class to make this button extra large. So we're going to go button x large. And inside we're going to say capital S A V E. All right. So if we go back here, refresh the page, we have a huge button here. Now let's make it bigger. Let's make it a, uh, we're going to create a custom style here because Bootstrap doesn't do everything for you. I looked into how I can do it, but you have to create a custom CSS style for this. So we're going to go button button x large and padding is going to be 18 pixels 28 pixels 45 pixels 28 pixels no wait, is that right 18 28 45 20 yeah that's very right so font size equals 22 pixels line height is equals to normal uh, webkit Border radius equals eight pixels. Moz border radius is equal to eight, pi eight pixels. And border radius is equal to eight pixels. All right, so go back here. We go back to our little application here. There you, go, there you go, we have a bigger save button. And that's what we want. We want to save our money so we get rich. Being rich is not about spending money. That's that's what you do when you're like a rapper or something. When you're a, uh, when you're a, planning on getting rich you save right guys you save your money you don't let it go anywhere you let it save in your bank account and grow that's where the term money grows on trees comes from it's when you save it in your bank account and money makes more money for you that's when money grows on trees so um all right so let's go back down here and now we're gonna do some uh we're gonna do some we're gonna do some vgs we got the we got we got the basic skeleton of our uh, application all right so guys I'm gonna uh, the minute is coming in close to 10 minutes so I'm gonna end this video and I will begin the actual VGS portion of our tutorial in the next video uh, so we got the skeleton down and now we just gotta do the VGS to add in the functionalities so I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial I hope you guys are having a wonderful day I hope you guys are having a wonderful time I really hope you guys are having fun learning programming because programming is what's gonna get the food on your table to grow and you can eat sushi every day of your life I love sushi or you can eat whatever like sushi is healthy pizza is not pizza I love pizza too I love Domino's pizza but it's not the most healthiest food on the earth. Sushi, you can't go wrong. It is more expensive, but sushi is healthy for you guys and tastes good. So 
eat healthy guys stay stay strong and i will see have fun and i'll see you guys in my next video